Okay, shoot. Hello. I'd like to introduce you to my 1965 356C. This is a very original car. It was owned by a couple named Morell who bought the car new for $4,200 in 1965. The car was restored in 2011 back to the standard it was when it was new. Uh, the car didn't need a full restoration, but we gave it a full restoration. Uh, it uh, is in its correct colors. Uh, it's uh, light ivory with black interior. It has matching numbers, matching transmission. Uh, the undercarriage is like new. Uh, the work was done by a Porsche race mechanic out in Arizona. It was originally a California car. I am the second owner. Uh, I have the title. Uh, the car runs perfectly. When we did the restoration, we put a little bigger cylinders on it, so it's uh, 1,720 cc's. It's about 105 horsepower. Uh, these wheels don't come with the car. These are Molly wheels. I do have the original wheels with great tires on them. Uh, I've done a couple little changes to the car. Uh, in addition to making it a little more of a hot rod with the cylinder change, I added the headrest and the steering wheel. I have the original steering wheel. Uh, the radio works. The clock works, every gauge, everything about the car works. It's uh, done to a one minus standard. It is not Pebble Beach, but it's close. It is a great driver. Uh, I have a spare tire and a jack, and I've also put uh, jack stands on the car, underneath the car in several places if you want to take a look at those. And that allows you to jack the car if you have a flat tire. Um, so the car is a very good driver. Uh, it's really an excellent driver. It is a show car. Let me show you the engine. Um, it runs perfectly, uh, it brakes perfectly, no issues with the car, everything works. Uh, and again, it's, it's a car that uh, there's 3,000 miles on the restoration. Sounds like my neighbor decided to uh, do his lawn right now. <laughs> but anyway, um, the car was finished by Tim Herman. Uh, he redid the uh, steering, got it, got it perfectly centered. And then uh, did some work on the uh, gearbox. Uh, it's a four-speed gearbox. I did the graphics to uh, do a tribute to Bill Graham, who owned the Fillmore East and the Fillmore West. So one side's Allman Brothers, the other side's Grateful Dead. All the graphics will come off. They're all just final graphics. They'll peel right off. They won't leave a mark. The paint's decent on the car. Um, I'd say it's probably a nine and a half out of ten. Everything else on the car is pretty much a ten. Um, good driver. Um, I think whoever gets it's going to be lucky. I didn't uh, want to resell the car. And all the chrome's original except for this piece right here. Uh, these two back windows had a little bit too much of the uh, fine rust on it, so we, we did replace these two windows. But all the other chrome on the car, including this, is all original. Um, the car was in great shape when we started the restoration. And of course, there's pictures of the restoration. Uh, I don't know what else I can say about the car. still a six volt car. All right, as you can see, all the gauges work on the car, including the clock. Um, the radio works, but uh, I want you to hear the engine and hear how sweet this car is. And just an amazing car. It has a little more pep than when it was new, but other than that, it drives like a stock 356. And it really is a pleasure to drive. The shifting is perfect on the car, and the car just runs so beautifully. Let's go through the neighborhood. We'll try to hit third gear here coming up this hill. Uh, we're not going to be able to get into fourth in the neighborhood, but just show you how nice it shifts. There we go into third. <laughs> 